Hello, welcome back. Last time, I found my way through Lost Sands and sort of stumbled into the wasp territory that I was warned about. Fought off some nasty wasps with my generic buddies Ganadary there. Um, so that was nice. Uh, caravan passed safely. Let's actually fight this. Why? I mean for this, uh, <laughs> what do they call star points in this game? Um, exploration points. Sure. But like, it's gonna wear me down like a lot. Because that's what it does. I can't do 11 damage in a turn without using TP, so let's use TP. In fact, I should have used some of yours. Alright, how much does a heavy strike do from the, like, very back? It only costs three. I think Kabu is by far my most effective fighter. The others are good, he's just better. <laughs> Uh, do you have a heavy hitting ability? Well, the answer is no. Um, I'll just ice fall so that I can maybe take them both out next turn. Okay, that wasn't too, too early. It was a little too early. It worked, though. Um... You know, another heavy strike could be enough. Hold on, but how much does this do? It does one, so don't even bother. Oh, okay, I do need to bother. That's fine. Well, it does do two. I thought you had more defense. Oh, right, Leaf's in the front. So, like, I'm all confused with Leaf being in the front. This is just not how I'm used to things. Kabu, be the party leader. I need you. Alright, so anyway, I uh, got a lot more desert to explore. I'm gonna knock down all the rest of these twigs and stuff on this screen and see what else I can find. I need to come back to the book when I get rock destruction abilities. This book right here. Uh, from here... Is there any left going that I can do? No. I have to come around to the left from another angle. And then I can open a shortcut. Okay, so when I get to that spot. It'll be nice and convenient to take the back exit. But I have to get there first. I can't jump up this, right? Kinda almost? What the heck? Are you sure about this? That? Okay, this doesn't feel right. I have to keep holding in that direction. I think the top of the book is non-walkable. Why do I keep trying? I think the top of the book is non-walkable, but it's cool that I can climb up that, I guess. Oh, right. Sand pit. Uh, okay. So find the way around. Is this the wheel screen? Yeah, this is the wheel. What was his name was there? I forgot. Here's the fork in the road. And I think this is the way I didn't go, so this should lead straight to the other side of the book? Yeah! And there's this... Oh. Which is nothing, this is just a fork in the road again. Okay! Well, I know where I am now, so is that just like, not even a way I can go? No, it's gotta be! So yeah, exit there... Maybe it's not a way I can go yet, but, like, rock destruction won't help me with that. I see something. It's a Psycorp. Okay. If I get up on top of this thing here, can I maybe jump the gap to the right from there? Oh, this gap persists. Don't fall in the quicksand, sure. There's stuff over it. Oh, hold up. Can a boomerang knock over a twig? No, just goes clock. Maybe those are things I get to from after I'm in Defiant Root. Or maybe the desert continues for a bit more than I was thinking it did. Okay, right, I did read that. Okay, um, fine. So that was a short detour. And there's nothing else interesting about this. Just a little underling to... No, wait, that's... Hold on, that's something new. I haven't fought you. What are you? Uh. 
Got a little sand shark here. I can't target it. Can get the cactuling though. I'm gonna take that opportunity. Arrow worm, I see. So you get it up so V can spy it. How's that sound? Not super great, because neither thing dies this turn, then. It'll be fine, though. That's an arrow worm, right? It's buried all the time, so I can't be super sure. <laughs> okay, so I probably could have spied it in the ground, then. 10, 0, all right. Oh, I leaf, get it out of the ground, or are we going to have to book it out of here? Hmm. All right, I took a guess. It wasn't right. I took a guess. It wasn't right. It's fine, I'm healing after this. Mildly annoying, but it's, you know. That's not the person I meant to be attacking now. Uh, I can still take this this turn, right? I think. Not without an ability. Fine, let's use an ability. Here, do this one. Let's see. Oh, dear. <laughs> Everything's gone wrong. I wasn't ready for that particular command. I was thinking of the other one. Well, I blocked it, partially, and you took some damage from that. Neat. All right. Um. Ugh. That may have been a mistake, because now I can't kill the cactuling, can I? All right, I'm making all the mistakes here. Um, fine, again, if I'm going to be healing anyway. Just use your stuff. I'm more sure I can kill this with this than if I hit the cactuling. All right, one person goes down. Let's find out if that was going to work or not. It was not, okay. I made the right choice. Oh, neat. Hey, I don't have to heal. The game heals me for me. How nice. And this is why you don't want to run away from battles all the time. I would love some metal points. I'd like all of these things, but metal points feel like they'll make the most difference. HP plus is for a single member. This would let me equip one, I think. Wouldn't really help the party's entire... Thing, but like I could help one person or I could equip different things right I do have oh it's only two. Oh, but it only increases by two I thought it was three okay that makes sense one per MP quite sensible so like I can pretend that I just leveled up TP until I want the MP for something else which is not too unreasonable Mm -hmm. That's five, and it's not equipped. This isn't currently important. I'm not great at super blocks, but I'd like to be better at them. This I can just avoid with skill. In theory. This I haven't been using, like, at all. Theoretically, I might want to, but I just... Oh, you know what? I should really just learn to use that. Um, how much does it cost, though? Uh, how do I... Two. That's nice and cheap. Yeah. I... Okay, so remember to use break. That should be, like, Leaf's default action on anything that has defense. Leaf goes first, breaks it, and then everybody else attacks. Okay, and I have 5 MP to allocate to something. Sturdy for whoever. But it's an active ability. Eh. That's pretty cool. Probably gonna go with back support. Whoops. Uh, for you. That seems completely reasonable. Sure. Okay, um, so I'm here. 
attempts to go a different direction didn't really go anywhere. That's okay. Is this a monster? It is. See, you totally can't tell. It really is just a cactus until you get close to it. But there might not be any non-monster cactuses that look like that. Uh, yeah, this was the way. So now I'm looking for a way around from a different angle. Uh, sure, you know what, let me save my blundering around in the sand. <laughs> See, because I kind of got the vibe that Defiant Root is just like one screen away from here. I figured there wouldn't be even more desert between here and there. I might be right. I'm not. Quite the cliff, isn't it? And a lot of cacti, too. So thirsty. I want to drink the cactus water. I'm going to jump in. Quick leaf, we must hold her back. <laughs> cactus water. Okay, I guess they must have some water there if it meant that many are growing. So no way around. I thought I saw something there. I did. Succulent berry, neat. Okay, well, V's thirsty. Two HP for three turns. Ooh, cool. Okay, so slow heal. Uh, should we fight? I guess we can. Ah! That didn't work the way I wanted it. Okay, so... Psycorp with the defense. Let's try this for two turns. Oh, hey, I don't even need to input anything. It just does it. So no difference for Kabu, right? Four. Maybe that was a difference. Man, this is also hard to keep track of. <sighs> so earlier with that. Oh, you burrow too! Well, you're dead anyway. Gonna have to turn relay, which is totally fine. You give your turn. Mostly just want that out of the ground. So my heavy hitter can hit it heavy. Early, early. Okay. Cool. Hey, you dropped a... a Garak Shroom. 6 TP and Num. Remind me what Num was? Num is sleep, isn't it? I think that's right. Uh, Defiant Roots just ahead. A welcome sight after so much walking. And a break from the harsh sun. We should drop by the inn and sleep in a nice bed. So there's a cliff all the way on the left. Clearly there's like stuff to do if I can get on top of it. Watch out, up ahead is the border with the Wasp Kingdom. If you're looking for Defiant Root, head west. Okay, right, so this is the actual intersection I was warned about. If I go right here, I might get into danger. Let's actually follow those instructions for once. I'll just sort of make a note. Uh, I changed my mind. Okay. What a big gate. This is the border with the Wasp Kingdom, so the area is heavily secured. I only see one guard, though. A new development. She, uh, wasn't here before. How safe would it be to talk to her? I don't trust it. It's been too long since I saved. Wasps are known to take the opportunity to ambush. Gonna see if I can save a Defiant Root before I mess with that. I'm gonna have to fight you, I'll bet. Seems like that's necessary. I gotta be, like, holding the Beamerang in place and stuff, so, you know. Easier to just get rid of you now. If you have two... Then a break should do some very good things. If you use both of them. In fact, that'll be enough to just straight up kill you. Neat. Ooh, 
That might just be one of my best abilities. See? That one's not as early as the other. It's just so hard to know. Uh, right, so you're not underground. You can't be flipped. You don't need to be flipped. Oh, but you are underground now. Right, so you have a reaction ability that does that. Keep that in mind. Okay, not as early. Well, that was a block, but I could have been a bit later still. Alright, we're gonna stay at an inn, maybe. As V suggests. I'm totally up for that. Oh, shoot, you're here. Um, can you not be... Eh, depends what friends are with you, whether I can fight you or not. Yeah, all right, let's do it. <laughs> After you've <laughs> completely gone back to neutral. It's fine. Okay, so you're gonna Tornado Toss. If I'm sleeping at an inn, no Hurricane Toss, then let's just go all out. Like, really, really just go all out. Sounds great. Uh, yeah, you know what? Is that enough for a frigid coffin or an ice fall? No. I could break. It's fine. Mm. Whoops, she fell over. <laughs> I'm not sure how many times I've failed that, but I don't really remember seeing that. That's pretty good. <laughs> Alright, it's nice to have enough TP that I can just, like, dump them into things like that. Ah, it's good to be back. Oh yeah, you mentioned staying here back with Neo. That means we've been neighbors all along. Life truly is full of small surprises like that. Uh, cute. Anyways, how do we get to the hive? We just keep going straight. There's a huge elevator there. Is it safe? No one's fallen off yet, so it's probably safe. Let's go get this over with already. Venus, watch over me. Is he afraid of heights or something? Hold on, did I do this here? Yes. Okay, uh, not much has changed. There's quite a few places I want to visit. Really? I usually just zoom past the town unless I need the inn. We're not familiar with the area. What's good in town, Kabu? North of here is a commercial district. The baker makes fantastic honey treats. Oh, neat. Seriously? The mayor's around here, too. I should greet him when I get the chance. Okay. V, you're the only bee explorer, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, that I know of. We've been thinking it's a bit weird to see so many bee guards, but only one explorer. Look, they're not guards because they want to or anything, okay? They were born to be guards, so they guard. That's it. That's a bit somber. That's just how the hive is sometimes. <laughs> Welcome travelers to Defiant Root. The town's name comes from the big tree's root, breaking through the lost sands. I know that already. <laughs> just doing my job. <laughs> A Sal's clinic. First consult is free. Is this... Hey, welcome. What's troubling you? We're not sick, just passing by. That's okay. If you're ever feeling bad, drop by. First consult's free. Ooh, this is so foreshadowing. Somebody's gonna get sick at some point along this trip, and we're gonna have to bring them here. Esau is such a relief to my eyes. She's treated many of my wounds. Your trip from the north sounds anything but fun. Really, though, it's not so bad to have someone else take care of you, right? Can't argue with that. Okay. Oh, whoops. 
I wanted to jump on the table and I still want to. I can't. I'm not allowed. <laughs> what a shame. Poor Dran. He's had it rough lately with all these bandits. Mm-hmm. Even though he is such a fine fellow, it's hard to escape super superficial judgments. He'll be fine, and if he's not, we can help. Leaf V, you two get more caring by the day. <laughs> That's a noise. Bandits have caused me some big trouble. If I wasn't blue, I reckon I'd be jailed by now. What? How are any of these three things connected to each other? I'm confused. <laughs> Whoa, look at this bug. Oh, it's an eye patch, I see. I thought that was just like some really spectacular coloration. <laughs> that eye patch, so cool. Seriously, Kabu? Those are for covering wounds, you know. Yeah, can't believe you're so insensitive. Wait, I said it was cool out of respect. <laughs> Have a good time before you head out. Best to go into a job without any regrets. Okay. Explorers for the ants, eh? If you're interested in doing your usual questing or whatever, check the board over there. Are there new quests? Of course there are! Three of them! Oh, hey, it's cut. Ultimate dish. Okay, so you... That doesn't look like a sliver of a pop can in your hand to me. I guess maybe just, like, metal is a rare sight, so, like, drink can, knife look like the same thing to bugs. Uh, ultimate dish. Tangy berry from the exotic golden seedling. Oh, yeah, I need to find one of those. Okay, this relates to one of my quests. Uh, I didn't read any of that, so let's read it this time. Crisby. Master of Sweets. Bakery. Okay, so Crisby is the baker here. Great. Uh, okay, I read it this time to myself. Hey, it's Vivi! Vivi's here! <laughs> he looks a bit different. My, my, I cannot leave my shift until further notice, but I really want to visit the Bee Kingdom. Could someone get a fashionable accessory from the Bee Kingdom in my stead? Meet me in the ant mines, okay? Uh, this is... Oh, what's her name? Kina. Kina's search for Maki continues. That's cute and all, but she better not forget her job. Knowing her, she's already finished. She's scary efficient when making time for Maki. Okay. Maki's still gone. I'm starting to get worried. He never takes this long to complete a mission. I am certain he's fine. Or maybe he... Shut up! He's fine! Right, yeah, isn't there like some kind of Maki side story going on here? This is... This is the continuation of something. Like, he's been missing for a while now, hasn't he? Nope, I don't want to talk to her. <laughs> Great, she's here too. Wonder what she's up to. Don't know, don't care. Isn't V being a bit too mean? Hold on, hold on, hold on. If you're not in the party lead, can somebody else talk to her? Nope. Ah, the bakery in this town is the best. By mixing flour with different ingredients, it's possible to create so many different pastries. I must taste all of them. So flour is perhaps the cake mix equivalent, then? Ah, we can't help but be bung uh, uh, hungry around this bug. No rush, Leaf. You two can hang out. Oh, we just might order some stuff, then. Don't mind if we join you. Okay. I don't really quite have the option, though. Here, Leaf, you be in the lead. No, still can't. There's a well here or something. I fell in it. Oh! And there's stuff! I'm thirsty. Let me out this water. <laughs> can't. Oh, hold on. Well, I need, to, I need to do a thing while I'm down there. Press this button. So we've come to the bottom of this well for not much, really. Yeah, it's just a bunch of water. It is a well. <laughs> and a convenient mushroom. <laughs> Man, what a boring well. There's nothing but water in it. <laughs> I don't know why bugs stay here. It's all sandy and stuff. You know, yeah, we wouldn't make this a permanent stay. It's a very tightly knit community with strong traditions. Can't they just do their traditions somewhere nicer? I swear, V. Hmm, <laughs> hey, careful around this well here, yes? You don't want to be falling in. Sure I do, it's fun. You have berry juice on top of your house. 
Oh, it's Morty's Bedbug Rental System. Welcome! A Bedbug Rental Service? Sir, what exactly do you mean? It's all in the name. This pillbug here is incredible, I tell you. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay, not that kind of bedbug. If you're tired, he'll lull you to sleep and heal you fully. Oh, nice. Let's rent it, team. Seriously? This sounds like a huge scam. But the pill bug... Look, I don't ever do this, but it'll earn your trust. First rental's free, how's that? As soon as you sleep, though, he'll come back to me. This is quite the interesting business model. Well, if the first try's free, I can't say no. Yes, yes. You won't regret it. He'll show you his superpowers. Neat, bad bug. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. The cute bed bug Morty lent you. It looks so peaceful while sleeping. A short nap won't hurt. He'll do his best, so take care of him, okay? We will. Oh, we will. <laughs> Don't forget we must return him. <laughs> Leaf is just so happy to have a pet, but like, he can't really show it. Is this a... Inventory item? No. Oh, hold on. There was a, um... Oh, it's a key item. So I could probably use this. I can. Okay, good to know. Now hold up, can I use the other items? Well, the map, sure. I haven't looked at this in a while, have I? Bagaria's lush outskirts connect all the four kingdoms together. Four kingdoms? Bee, ant, wasp, and unknown. Uh, this vast desert in the heart of Bagaria houses bandits and many dangerous creatures. However, many ancient artifacts are scattered here, which attracts explorers. Whoops. Uh... This settlement was built to house travelers crossing, uh, crossing the desert to visit the hive. However, it's gained its own identity as a bustling merchant town. Okay, cool. Uh, right, library. Something updated. Was it a discovery? Yes. Built below the big tree's root and lucky enough to be over a water well, Defiant Root is a town that stands strong against all odds. Also... Arrow worm. The arrow worm is the most hated pest of the lost sands, annoying villagers and bandits alike. Its sharp teeth can cut through many strong materials, leaving many homes with more windows than they need. <laughs> uh, that's actually not great, but still. Explorer efforts have been made to lower their numbers with moderate success. Oops. Uh, right. If I remember correctly, this local beast always stays beneath the sand, waiting to devour prey. Its teeth are so sharp that they can bite through stone. Leaf, we will need your assistance. Our enemy is a rustling sand? Just kidding. It seems to be a buried sand-dwelling worm of some kind. Our ice magic should take care of it before it can bite us. Now, did I read these? I don't think so. These dragonfly thieves lurk within the lost sands. The buzz their wings produce while flying hinders their sneakiness, yet their mug tackle is 100% effective. Voted the cutest members of the desert bandits. The other members make sure the dragonflies eat first during times of scarcity. A thief! There's nothing worse in the world! The nerve to steal my hard-earned treasure! <laughs> I'm gonna knock him out of the air and take everything he's stolen. Uh, right. In this game, you do get your items back. I'm playing multiple games right now where, like, similar mechanics exist, but they're all slightly different. Darn, that flying thief keeps stealing my favorite snacks, and I can't reach him at all. Quick team, we must defeat him before he uses them for himself. Uh, right. I already saw that part. Bandit. Uh, scene four. These cricket bandits spark fear amongst all caravans traveling through the harsh desert. They are ruthless and efficient, and they have no intent to negotiate. They change completely when amongst their brethren. They act like older siblings to the dragonflies and even enjoy gardening. <laughs> uh, steal my boomerang. I don't know if I read that. Well, there it was. Cricket bandit. Be ready, you rascal. Man, I have no idea which character I spied with. None of these look especially familiar to me. Ladybugs turn to crime after their exile. Poor reputation, despite their crimes. Actions only make that dream farther away. 
fast tackle. Uh, right, this was the one I spied with. Shame how Bagaria seems so unsafe these days. Right, okay, so not as many bandits in Leaf's days, maybe. Maybe. At least, that's his impression. Uh, alright. And it was just a burglar, a bandit, and a thief in that fight, I think. Well, no, there was a wasp, a different sort of... What kind of wasp was that? Not Zasp. You, the wasp trooper. Maybe. Or scout. Yeah, scene two, because I did die once in that fight. Do not be fooled by this soldier's petite figure. Wasp scouts are just as deadly and vicious as the rest of the army. Using their prowess in flight, they honor their name by scouting ahead to ensure a smooth operation. Hmm. Those scouts did return alive from seeing what we did. We were really only defending ourselves, but I'm sure they'll tell a different story since they were the, <laughs> the victims in their minds. Uh, aim super well. Can't let him call for more friends, right? Scoundrel, I will give you a chance to retreat before V knocks you down. No? Then face our wrath. Even if you call for reinforcements, we won't falter. Right, so everybody's call talking about calling for reinforcements. That never happens. We don't need your annoying buzzing in our ears. You won't be able to call for backup while frozen. We'll make sure to send you flying back to your king, trapped inside an ice cube. <laughs> All right, then. Leaf does have strong feelings sometimes. Hey, how's the little guy doing? We couldn't be happier. Just don't hang on to him too long, okay? I must say, Morty's services were better than I expected. It's super useful to rest anywhere. If I was him, I'd charge way more. The idea that our dear bed bug could be rented to another bug team. We must... Uh, uh, to another bug. Team, we must keep renting at all costs. Uh, just remember we don't own it or anything, okay? <laughs> Man, Leaf is just so happy to have this pill bug. It's great. How do I get that berry juice? Like this? Okay, great. Kabu, you came to visit. Care to stay in chat? You look familiar. I've met you before, haven't I? Maybe not. Where would I have seen the mayor of... Def Maybe at the festival? You look so familiar. Mayor, thank you. I'm currently on a mission, however. I'll come back again. Anytime, Kabu. Bring your friends, too. Getting to the mayor's house is super weird, isn't it? Uh, we think it's a cute method. Regardless of the route, this is a great place to live in. He can easily oversee the whole town from here. Look, all I'm saying is he could have paid for some stairs. <laughs> but, like, the staircase built out of junk is free. We get a lot of bee tourists since we're so close by, but we don't really return the favor. I've been thinking of going on an adventure up there myself, but it's hard to find the time. Not like he's missing much. <laughs> Say, the citizens of this town really enjoy that pattern on their clothing, don't they? Well, they're simple to weave yet appealing. I could see why it'd be a hit. Now we should open our own clothing line with squares instead of triangles. No way, circles would look way better. I'll keep my triangles, thank you very much. <laughs> Alright, there's a save. Okay, there's probably an inn here somewhere. Um, if not, I can use the bed bug, I guess, because I do need to sleep. But Alright, so that's Defiant Ritz, part of it at least. This sign is like super stretched out and weird. It's bothering me, so I'm going to quit. <laughs> I'll see you next time. <laughs>